Hello, my name is Dr. Carlo Oyer, emergency physician and founder of edexitvideo.com, a website that provides free patient medical education videos about diagnosis related to emergency department care. In this video, we're going to be talking about the subconjunctival hemorrhage. The conjunctiva is the thin, moist, transparent membrane that covers the white part of the eye. Underneath the conjunctiva lies nerves and small blood vessels. These are small and can barely be seen. They are fragile, and when they break, they result in a subconjunctival hemorrhage. What are the causes? Most are spontaneous and no obvious cause is found. But sneezing, coughing, straining, vomiting, rubbing your eye, trauma, high blood pressure, and bleeding disorders like somebody who takes blood thinners, aspirin, Coumadin, Plavix, Seralto, etc. What are the symptoms? Well, most of the time, it is not associated with any symptoms. It may be associated with a sense of fullness or irritation of the eye. Diagnosis. Examination alone is enough to make the diagnosis. However, there should be no blood if you blot the eye with tissue. Treatment. Well, no treatment is necessary, but you may use over-the-counter eye drops to treat the irritation. Follow-up. You must follow up with an eye specialist if the condition does not resolve within two weeks or if you have had multiple episodes of the same. You must return to the emergency department if you develop any neurological symptoms, if you have pain associated with the bleed, if you experience any kind of vision changes, and if the area suddenly um, bleeding increases in size. For other videos like this video, please go to www.edexitvideo.com. But remember that these are educational videos and should never replace the advice or attention of a medical professional.